Hi, I'm Ryan with Green Zone Fitness, and today I'm going to be talking about gluten. So, if you have celiac disease or if you're gluten sensitive, and you've been doing your best to eat gluten free, but you're still experiencing some symptoms, you may be getting gluten from hidden sources. So, we find it in all sorts of things. We're going to go over our top six. Just so you know, gluten is protein. It's responsible for the elastic texture in most doughs, and it's found pretty much in anything made with wheat rye or barley but did you know it's found in these other products let's take a look these are our top six hidden sources for gluten the first one is bottled sauces and marinades for instance soy sauce it's a common ingredient it's found in many marinades sauces and it's served in most asian restaurants and even other restaurants and it's also sold in most grocery stores but did you know that with soy sauce the second ingredient is actually wheat so that would be a big problem if you're on gluten. So watch out for the soy sauce. Instead, you should choose a liquid amino. It's purely vegetable based and water. So this will be fine for somebody who's gluten sensitive. Number two, processed meats. So things like sausages, deli meats, meatloaf, meatballs, and other ground meats often contain meat based fillers. And breadcrumbs, they're used to improve the texture and bind the meat. Um, you may not know, also, imitation crab meat, like the kind you find in seafoods and many California style sushi rolls, also contain gluten. Number three, vegetarian and vegan meat alternatives. You might think you're safe by buying meat, but many meat alternatives, such as veggie burgers, bacon, veggie sausages, they're made with wheat gluten and others are made with gluten containing flours or breadcrumbs that act as binders to hold everything together. And while tofu in its original form is gluten free, the kind you're going to find in Asian restaurants is probably um, battered in some sort of soy sauce or breadcrumb mixture that definitely has wheat gluten. Number four, canned and pre-prepared soups. So in most of those soups, you're gonna find noodles or barley. They're very common ingredients and they always contain gluten. Also, cream soups are often thickened with flour, which means they also contain gluten. Number five, processed potatoes. Whole potatoes found in the produce department are gluten-free, but potato chips and fries are hidden sources of gluten. Potato chips may be seasoned with malt vinegar or contain wheat starch. You also want to be cautious of french fries. Restaurants often purchase the frozen kind, which may have a wheat containing coating on them to help them fry up crispier. Secondly, the fryers they're fried in are contaminated if they're used to fry other items with breading or flours. Number six, restaurant scrambled eggs and omelets. These things can be tricky because the restaurants typically put pancake batter in them to make them more fluffy. And furthermore, even if the egg mixture is gluten-free, it's probably cooked on a skillet or grill that's cooked some sort of gluten-containing food such as pancakes. Okay, let's talk real quick about the code words for hidden gluten because you can find them on menus and restaurants or the ingredients list on nutrition labels. So it's important to be conscious of words that are like fried, coated, crispy, crusted, these should raise red flags immediately, alerting you that the food probably contains gluten. What's happening is they're probably coated with a breading or gluten-containing flour. So here's a list of common foods that typically contain gluten, along with some ingredients that oftentimes contain gluten as well. So we hope this video is helpful. Let us know if you have any questions. Be sure to like and subscribe so you can catch all of our future content.